our product requiring high current stability. So when you receive the product, it's very, very important to use our original cable plug and the charging cable. We have already put UK or EU adapt in the box. So you need to use the cable and adapt. Please don't use other bad quality charging cable and plugs. It will have problems to use the device. So this is very, very important. First step, we need to install the app. There are two apps, IKOS and Simplus app. These two apps both can work with the device. So you can install the app from the App Store. This app and this app. So you choose one which you like. So now I use IKOS app to show how you how to connect the device. After you install the app, then you open the app and please allow all the requests. This can let you, your device, work well. Okay, and you need to make an account for this app. So, any account and passwords is okay. Let me make a new account. Okay. Then I log in. Now we insert the SIM card. This is SIM 1, this is SIM 2. SIM 1 supports 4G and it's another SIM card. I put this in SIM 1 and it supports 4G and this supports SIM 2. direction to SIM card and connect the power okay and wait about one minute about one minute later and then we open the city and uh, turn on the Wi-Fi and this device will show a hotspot. And we check. It's not coming. So we took off the Wi-Fi and turn on it again. Yes, it's coming this Wi-Fi W36004G. Okay, and we connect it. And the password is 1234567A. Okay. So let's keep connecting this hotspot. We must keep this hotspot. Then we back the app. And click remote device. And click here. 
and it will jump to the website. This website. And you also can come here, Safari, and then input this website here. It's, it's both okay. And it, it will jump to this page. And I, because this device is already connected to the Wi Fi, so it's not jumped. The, the window asked me to connect the Wi Fi. But first time, if you connect the device and it will jump to a page and ask you to connect the Wi Fi, you just press OK. OK. And then it will jump to this page and it will list the Wi Fi near you. OK. You just charge your home Wi Fi. And then into the password here. After that, maybe five seconds, and the internet, the device will connect you with your Wi-Fi, home Wi-Fi, and then the internet should connect. So that means it's okay. And just check, check the internet connect, and it's okay. So. Uh, in order to make sure the device connect with your road Wi-Fi, we open a new any website and just check this hot sport can work or not. Yes, it's coming. You can see I still connect this hotspot and then the hotspot have internet, it can open website. So that means the device already gets the internet from your router. It's connected with Wi-Fi successfully. Okay. Right? Okay. After the device connect with your road Wi-Fi then you back to the app back to the app then you clean the remote device and the searching device and it can get the device name here and this time you must make sure you connect the hotspot if if it connects to other your home Wi-Fi, then you can't get searching the device name. For example, if I switch, because sometimes you know the Wi-Fi will jump to your home Wi-Fi. At this time, you can see what happened. It's kind of searching, right? It's asking you to connect the Wi Fi directly. So I need back to this app. Make sure it's connected to this hotspot. And then back here, it's sh press searching and then biting. Sure, the signal here, right? So we must finish the configuration. And this step, everything is finished, and the device can work. And then you can back to the city, and you switch to your home Wi-Fi or 4G later. Okay. I switch to this one and don't connect this Wi-Fi hotspot again because you use your home Wi-Fi the speed is more fast. Okay? So disconnect with this Wi-Fi, this hot hotspot. Okay? And now if I make a call.
you can see it's still keep 4G. So that means this call is by 4G network. Use 4G network to make call. So the call quality is more better than 2G. And you can see the call quality is very good now. So I hope you can understand how to make the 4G device work because it's not as simple as the 2G and the 3G device. And the, 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 the most difficult thing for the 4G device is to need to pair the device with your home Wi-Fi. But 2G and the 3G device connect the network cable and it's okay. But this device, 4G device need to connect with your Wi-Fi. So it's a, a little difficult. So if you still don't still have uh, questions, you can contact my WhatsApp and uh, and tell me your question and I will help you to solve the problem. So thank you so much for watching my video. Thank you.